Working remotely in Airbnbs can be easy and enjoyable, but it can also be a total disaster. It really depends on the specific Airbnb you book, and in this video, we're going to give you three tips to ensure that you have a smooth and pleasant experience. First, be honest and mindful of your actual needs. What you need will vary depending on the type of remote work that you do, and nobody knows your unique needs better than you do. Be honest with yourself, and be mindful of your needs while you search. I used to say that I could work anywhere that I could get a decent internet connection. After months of working in different Airbnbs, I now know that that is not true. I also need a relatively quiet space to shoot my videos and record my audio. I need a place to store all of my gear where it will be safe and I don't have to worry about someone breaking in and taking it. I need a good desk and a comfortable chair for those long days that I spend writing, researching, and managing my teams. Honestly, I need a lot more than just a good internet connection, although a bad internet connection is still a deal breaker. While looking for listings, pay extra attention to the description and the photos. Does it mention a laptop-friendly workspace? Do you see a desk and a comfortable chair? Is the neighborhood safe? Is there good lighting? Do they have a printer or other equipment? Does it mention anything about nearby noisemakers like trains or factories? Be careful, and if you have any questions, always ask your host. Second, choose an Airbnb that has enough space for you to work well and comfortably. Some Airbnbs are barely more than closets with a bed in them. If you're attempting to work remotely in an Airbnb, then you need to make sure that you reserve a space that has adequate space for you to work and live in. Don't just look for a working space. As a remote worker, you are likely to spend more time in the Airbnb than most people will. Make sure that you will be comfortable in the entire place, not just at your desk. Third, make sure that the Airbnb has a great internet connection. You'd think that in 2021, Wi-Fi would be a standard feature, but it's not. Internationally, and even within the United States, there are many Airbnbs that do not have any internet connectivity at all. Depending on the type of remote work that you do, you may need a robust internet connection. Be wary of listings that mention high-speed internet in vague terms. Most hosts rely too much on what their ISPs promise and not what they actually deliver. Before booking an Airbnb, always ask for a screenshot of the Wi-Fi speeds before you book. This will help you get a better idea of the speeds that are actually present within the building. For more tips about living and working in an Airbnb, be sure to check out our other videos and subscribe to our channel.